Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We're taking a look at one of the best selling bunkhouse travel trailers in the entire RV industry. This is the 2021 Primetime Tracer model 24 DBS. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about this travel trailer and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video. My name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews, Tobles. It's the world's only channel giving you that true and biased review about everything when it comes to travel trailers, fifth wheels, and toy haulers. And again, today I am super excited to be taking a look at one of the best selling travel trailers for general, the Tracer. Now, Andrea, Andrea, when we do these reviews, not you can't get these at, you can only get units at certain select dealerships. I actually believe we sell this unit at all 13 of our locations nationwide, which is super exciting. Now, before we begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey, Andrea. Hi, everybody. How's it going? It's going good, you guys. We're still here in Jacksonville. Yep. Uh, trying to get you guys the reviews that you guys requested. Yeah, so. and look behind you. We'll be doing that one next, huh? That reflection. Burr, 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 burr. Make sure you subscribe to see it. Let's begin. Model is 24 DBS, but the actual tip to tip length of this travel trailer is 27 feet 11 inches. The dry weight is 5,324 pounds, and the hitch weight is 629 pounds. What I do love about this travel trailer is uh, even it's an ultra lightweight travel trailer, but there's a lot of high run features. Right here, we have a nice lipper component power tongue jack. All you do is just push the button to race it on and off the hitch of your truck. Right here, we do have place for two propane tanks. And right there is where you can put batteries and you can put a second 24 battery on it. Look at this nice black diamond rock plate right here. And then look what's going on here, Andrea, with this fiberglass cap. Isn't it kind of weird and groovy? Yeah. I've never seen anything like that. It kind of bulges out. Um, and I like it. And they got the LED lights on there. Yeah, LED lights. It looks very futuristic, spaceship-like, and everything. Right here on these side marker lights, they are prepped for the Furion. Oh, wow. I like that. Fiberglass sides, aluminum frame. And then check out that storage. Nice. Oh, and look at this. Oh, that's for the power stabilizing jacks. Yes, power Very stabilizing nice. jacks. Oh my gosh, and look at this. Wow. Slam latch doors, I love that. Again, this is this is an ultra lightweight travel trailer, and this is all about price point at the same time. This is giving you everything those trailers are giving you, but by keeping the price down, I Still love that. Still has high end features though. Yeah, and, and, and part of the reason why is because since we're able to sell these at all 13 of our locations, now we have 13 stores buying them in volume so we get bigger discounts than having just one at one store. You know what I'm saying? Right. Uh, right here, we do have a, a place for you to put your dog, lease them up. Look at these nice big power awning with LED lights. Let's take a look at it when it's all the way out. Great, nice power awning with LED lights. And look at this. This is something silly. I like how the door can open all the way and it's not messing up the awning. Yes, And good point. if you need the awning to pinch, you go like this and then it can lean one way or another. Cool. Love that. Oh, love the LED lights. Nice slipper component, solid steps. You guys know, you guys already know we love that. Again, fiberglass sides. Uh, bonded aluminum structure, very nice built, very awesome. Extended season package. That means it's good for three to four seasons. Just depends on where you are in the country. It's good for three seasons in Canada, but four seasons in Florida. <laughs> <laughs> Check out these tires, Jay. Oh man, they're the trailer kings. ST 205 75R14. Right here, we got power on the outside, coax on the outside. Love that. Speakers, they light up blue and be they're beautiful. Beautiful? Beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful, yes. And then check this out. A full size outside wow. kitchen. Wow. I love this. Nice little fridge. Nice little skillet stove top thing in do. We have a two burner. Yep, two burner cooktop. 
and a little sink. Now, the sink isn't plumbed through, but it still is a sink. And you have electrical outlet back there, and guys, you have a quick connect right there. Yes, propane quick connect. Coming around the back, we do have a nice place for your stinky slinky. Nice little bumper there. Right here's your water heater, very nice. Spare tire, spare tire carrier. You know what we should do, Andrea? What? We should start selling um, Mac RV reviews. Um, tire covers? Yes. Oh, yeah. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> That'd be cute. And then right back there, we do have the prep for fear around backup camera. Let us know, guys. Would you guys buy one of those? I think, see, the whole thing is I think they'd have to be like $19.99. Yeah. You know, or maybe we just give them out if somebody buys a travel trailer. Yeah. Come I around think that's that. a great idea. We got a 30 amp power cord right there, or um, place for one. Right there, that's your sewer connection where you dump your black and gray tank. I like the rim action going yeah, on right there. That looks it looks good. It looks sharp. And over here's your low point drains. Here's the other side. Oh man, look at this. Here's look your wet bag. That. Clean, beautiful, nice, awesome. Outdoor shower, good. black tank flush, potable water fill. Potable. Potable. Wow, Matt. Potable. That looks really Andrea. good. Andrea. Potable. Potable. Awesome. Sorry, guys. I was taken away by this wet bay here. It yeah. just looks great. Then the other side of the storage. I love these slam latch doors right here. And then, Andrea, look at this. You guys want to pause the video and scan that um, with your iPhone. You'll be able to get some awesome uh, information about that. Cool. Well, Andrea, I'm going to say the outside is pretty impressive, but it is equally as impressive on the inside. Let's go take a look. Check it out. All right, here we go. Here we go now. Okay. U shaped dinette. Uh huh. Box. Yep. See what's going on here in the bathroom. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. Let's get started up here. I don't want to spoil nothing. Let's get started up here. Oh, in there. I'm going this way. Here in the bedroom area, we do have a queen size bed. We got storage on this side and storage right there, Andrea. So we got a wardrobe yep. on both sides of the bed. We've got places on the side of the bed, push CPAP machine. Yes, you got cell like phone a chargers, plugs, and everything. Table here. And then up here, you can still put some nooks and crannies. Shelf. And it's a good size bed. Okay, oh, very smart. interesting. Smart. I'll tell you guys why this is smart later. Um, that is very smart. This is where you put your TV right yes. there. Yes. Okay, we'll, we'll go over that in a little bit. And then this does slide. And then is there storage under the bed? Yay. There sure is. It's pretty nice. Now, there is a window on this side. Uh-huh. I no don't, window on I don't know side. about those balances, but... What? You don't like those balances? No. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay, so... Wow. Over here in the living room area. Here's your TV. Already comes with a TV. Furion sound bar, and I love that. A lot of times, Andrea, when you're looking at the competition's travel trailers, uh, they won't put the TV in just to save a little bit of money. And that TV looks like it will swell out, too. Yep, yep. Right here, we do got storage. Nice Furion sound bar and everything. And then over here, again, small travel trailer, so there is no sofa. And I don't have a problem with that in this one, because this, oh my god, That is a nice, big U-shaped dinette. I wish they put this type of U-shaped dinette in motorhomes. I know. Nice U-shaped dinette, and it's comfortable, you know? And that does drop down to make a bed. Sure does, and a long bed, and a yes, size bed. Yes, absolutely, and I love that big window. Yes. So it's not a frameless window, so you can slide it. You got a window right here. Oh man, I wish they put a window right I there know. as well. But still, very nice, very fancy, and really, it's a great trailer at a great price. Which means it's now time for the MSRP. MSRP on this travel trailer here is wow. You ready for this? I'm ready. You were, if, if you guys saw two days ago's videos, right? This one is only $32,999. MSRP. That is not sale price. Wow. That's absolutely incredible. Sale price is going to be somewhere in the 20s, y'all. 
it's not going to be 30 it will be somewhere in the 20s as you can see we can't advertise sale price but here's what you do go down in the description below links below to generalrv.com to this exact unit go to generalrv.com click get lowest price or click the virtual rv show price somebody from my team will reach out to you to let you know the best price and the only thing you have to do andre is tell them what tell them you saw it on matt's rv review and you will get the absolute best price on this unit in america Burr. tell let them that you want the matt price tell them that and we will get you the best price andrea let's continue the video no time out 32.999 that's a great if if this unit cost that that would be great the fact that that's the MSRP. I know. <laughs> dude, you guys are crazy. This is, there's a lot of entry level travel trailers that, that MSRP. Oh, I know. At 40,000. Exactly. That's an amazing price. So I'm kind of interested to see what the sale price is. Yeah, we're going to Google it later. All right, guys, check this out. You have cabinetry on this side as well. Yep. The yep. Uh, island or peninsula island. Solid surface countertop. Yes. I mean, that's what I said. It has high end features in here. Yep. Okay, so here's the cabinet up here. Very nice. Good amount of storage. I like that they did give you a window here. Uh-huh. Interesting. Very interesting backsplash. Do you like the backsplash? Um, no. <laughs> oh, I like it. I don't know. A nice good. square sink. I mean, rectangle. It's, it's a rectangle. It's, it's actually not bad. If you're going to insult the backsplash, Sorry. make sure you call Sorry, this a guys. rectangle. Rectangle sink. Shapes. Shapes matter. Res shapes matter. Okay. Re respect. I, I apologize. Respect the name of the shapes. Look at me, Matthew. Oh, it's hot. I'm pretty sure people are going to forgive me. <laughs> <laughs> but this is not, I mean, it's okay. It's not bad, honestly. I've, yep. I've seen a lot worse. We got a cabinet over here. And we got four drawers. What are you trying to say? It's 100 degrees and you're allowed to make a mistake or so? <laughs> it's 100 degrees. It probably is 100 degrees yeah, in here. Yeah, it feels like 100 degrees. And you know why? Because this trailer's so well insulated. Yes, definitely. <laughs> Uh, we got a microwave up here, you guys. They gave you a Furion. Furion. Wow. Furion everything. Look, look. That's gr that's great, actually. So, so this actually the uh, exhaust vent. Yes, that's actually really good. I have not seen a Furion in anything. I like that. Yep, very nice. Okay, and you got a three burner cooktop mm -hmm. with the glass cover. Of course, it's Furion. And of course, you get the Furion oven. Burr, 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 burr. That's exciting. We got a two-way Dometic refrigerator. Yep. Runs off your propane and shore power. And electric. They know what shore power means, Matt. I know, I know. <laughs> you got a pantry right here. Very nice. Or you could use it for linens. Yep. And you know what, Matt? I think we forgot there was storage under the dinette. Oh man, look at that. That sure is nice. On both sides. Wow. Awesome. All right. Okay. You're going in the, the bunk this time. I did it last time. I'm going in. <laughs> Your turn. Oh, what say you? I say it's pretty comfortable, if I must say so. USB. Look at this. Got a curtain over there. Well, not a curtain, a little cover, privacy cover. Yep. Very nice. Very nice. Very comfortable. We got storage below. What's the max weight, we think? Uh, At least 150 pounds, which okay. is my weight. <laughs> Sink. And very nice. Oh, All right. This bathroom. I I was oh shocked that it gave you that type of shower. Yes. And then look at this. We got the magic fan. Oh my god. There's look even a seat this. in there. What? There's even a seat in there. This is a look huge at that. huge shower. I love that. Look at the medicine cabinet behind you. Great height. Very nice. I like how, you know, they have the little sink in here and you got perfect place for a trash can. Yep. They did a great job on the shower. I'm actually really shocked that it's that big. And, and the glass door. Yes. It's now time for the toilet test. Womp womp. Womp womp. But it's okay. No, it's not okay. No? Nope. It's a great placement. And I'll tell you that in a second. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Man, we knock out these travel trailers fast, don't we? We do. I mean, shoot, we're at only 11 minutes. And as great as it is, and as nice as it is, Andrea, it's now time we give everybody three things we love about this travel trailer and three things we dislike. What are we doing first? Um, 
We're gonna do three things we like about it. Nope. Okay. Dislikes. Go ahead. Sorry, sorry. Sorry about that. Here's why. This travel trailer is so nice, so luxurious. Everything is so well designed. They should have put a porcelain toilet in. Absolutely unacceptable. Look at these countertops. I know, I know. They've got right. solid surface countertops. You couldn't put a porcelain toilet and on my bottom? And they have a nice glass shower in there that has right. a seat. Right, Now don't worry y'all, it can be swapped out. And for the low, low price of $2.99, we will swap it out for you for a porcelain toilet. Actually, I don't know the price, but that's pretty funny. So that's one dislike. Two, do you have a dislike? Of course. Tell me. Guys. I really like the high-end features of this, but I gotta say, I do not like this at all. The pattern? I do not like it. Okay. I feel like it's just, I don't know. Just not your cup of tea? No. Just you, ladies, you, gentlemen, let me know what you think. You like decaf and they're selling a cappuccino, that's all. <laughs> just different flavors, different shirts it's for really, different folks. It's really a big dislike. I would have to change it. Here's the good news. It is changeable. I mean, you can just make make the stuff yourself. We can do anything nowadays. We, A, with money, anything's possible. And with the sale price of this unit, I mean, you'll have plenty of money left over to uh, change that. So that's two. And then three is right here. I hate when the sinks aren't real sinks. They're just bowls to collect water. So how this outdoor sink works is you take it and then you dump it out you take it and you it's dump it out. It's not plumb through. It's not plumb through. I don't like that. Uh, I just wish it was plumb through. But at the same time, at least it gives you a sink. I'm just not a huge fan of that. Okay. Great. So that's three things we dislike about this travel trailer. Now it's time for three things we love about it. You ready for me to go first? Sure. Look at this awning. I know. Huge. Listen, nope. I'm not saying the awning. I'm saying all the outside features. I still love this outside kitchen, just not the sink. I love this huge power awning. I love the electric stabilizing. Me too. I love the tires and I the rims. I love the steps. The steps, the slam latch door under there, the power tongue jack and everything. Yes. Aluminum structure, structure and four seasons. I love that. So that's one. Andrea, two. Okay. I really like that they gave you solid surface countertops yep. in here. This kit, no, no. It, the kitchen. Yes, that's what I mean. In the kitchen, it's great. It, you know, and look, they gave you Furion appliances. That's awesome. That is awesome. The ovens. I like the, the rectangular microwave. sink. They did a great job. Beautiful job on the kitchen. Yes. I know you kind of don't like the backsplash. I'm okay with it. Um, but just really, really nice. Again, this this unit's gonna sell in the twenties. Sure. And so Absolutely. to have that, it's awesome. And then three, I'm gonna combo it. I love the big bunks, but I gotta say, I mean, I'm sorry. This sounds like that shower, y'all, is so big and nice. Freaking amazing. No, I'm saying I love everything that's big in here. Big U-shaped dinette, big shower, and big beds and over there. They did there. a great job. Yep, and you know what? I gotta add one more thing sure. I totally forgot. You walk in there. I'll remember the TV. Yep. So I hate this style of bedroom where you have to they shut pocket the door. doors. Yeah. So, but here's how it works for all the other brands. You have to close the door to watch the TV. This little bracket right here makes it so you can still have a TV with the doors open. Yes. That's just. That's yep. just. That's makes awesome. Sense. Well, let's go outside, Andre. Because it's nice out. Especially under this awning here. Yep. Here we stand right there. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you everybody so much for watching. If you guys have any questions about this RV and you want to contact me, feel free. My personal cell number is 301-906-0962 or check out my website. It's mattsrvreviews at gmail.com uh, where you can get your official Matt's RV review sticker. Bing! Also, there's a contact me tab on that page where it will send me an email and it will go directly to my email. Um, or if you want more information and pricing and you want to find out the true sale price again y'all We sell these at all 13 of our dealerships nationwide So that's 13 dealerships of buying power to get um, the absolute best price in America on these I'm telling you Nobody will sell them cheap cheaper than us in America. So just go to down in the description go to generalrv.com 
I have a link that will take you straight to the tracer. Uh, click get lowest price. All the only thing you gotta do is tell them you saw it on Matt's RV reviews, <laughs> and you will get the best price. Andrea, do you have anything you want to say? Always. Hey everybody, thanks so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Uh, Prime time, we'll be reading the comments, so we appreciate everybody's feedback. Um, is it our last day for? Yes, last day. This is the last day for the keychains. Bing! You guys, I really hope you got a chance to get one because this is the last day, and then after this, we're not selling them anymore. You better not mess up, America. <laughs> um, I hope you guys are safe and you guys are doing well. Thanks for watching. Yep. Thank you so much for watching, Andrea. We'll, we'll see, see you next time. time.